yeah so what i'm going to do now is i'll go in for the pen tool then i'll create one point here i'll create another point here so this is what we are going to do okay now i'm creating this baby flyer it's like uh, a product flyer okay how we used to create business flyers and do stuff guys i'm using that method to create this baby flyer so assuming a person gave you more than two or three pictures for one design that is how you should do it okay and it's it's, it's very nice when you do it that way so what i've done is i've created a shape like that and i'm plating my image beneath that shape so this is the image i'm using for the work okay this beautiful lady as you can see she's very beautiful see yeah so she's a nice if you if you want her don't don't dm me i will not give it to you i will not give it to you at all please don't come closer cry so what we are going to do now is go in for the pen tool again and look for hold the control key sorry hold the control key click on the point that you created okay so that you have something like this the slanted shape like this on the top then going for the cavity tool and create the curves okay so we are creating curves here so you create something like uh this okay when you're using the cavity tool curving is very easy you can also use the pen tool and then hold the odd key to create a curve but i like using the cavity because that one is easy so what i've done right now is i've make a copy of the first layer so with the first layer i'll change that color to gold or something like yeah gold so what i'll do is i'll pull this upper layer the first copy the copy okay shape one copy i'll pull it up a little then we have something like this so you know the point i'm getting to what i'm going to do now is i rasterize the image okay as you can see i've rasterized this image i'll click on remove background when you rasterize the image and remove background it's very easy so it's going to remove the background now the background is we have white against white and sometimes because of color uh, you will find it difficult to differentiate between the two colors because the, the person is wearing white and your image is also oh the background is also white so it's quite difficult so i'll just bring in something like uh this although it's white but it can differentiate between the head and and it's also had some star to it so this is my texture so this texture it does not mean when you're designing or you want to design similar thing you have to use my if you want to practice along this what you need to do is you need to go online sometimes i always want you to fish okay so that anytime i don't provide you can also know how to do it just go to online and search for white background you will see different kind of textures and then note their names when you are downloading them note the different names for them so that anytime you want some you just go here and google that name and you get different type of same textures okay so play that one out then of my sorry i've made copies of this ellipse too so i've created two ellipse then i'll go in for the image she sent to me actually i'm supposed to i'm supposed to use two of this image so i'll just go in for this one and then clip it inside so as you can see i didn't go in creating the creeping mask like right, right click and then you can use the shortcut ctrl alt g to clip the image then i'll go in for this second picture all the pictures are key in front they are too they are touching i can't even focus on the design the pictures are just very attractive is she is beautiful okay but she is not the target for our design i want to focus on the design what i'm doing so this is the present so as you can see the same method we use when we are creating business flyers or food flyers whatever like So from here what I'm doing now is I've 
added my uh, second texture to it then what I would do right now is to change to change the blend mode okay but you see the blend mode the color is black so the background color is black so changing the blend mode would be something difficult here because I want the thing to appear in this black uh, background so what I can do is to reduce the opacity down so that I can get my design in there I've already created some birthday design so I'll go in for this test here and then I'll change the color and then I'll place the same information here for the sake of time so I'll place the same information so today is the day you have been waiting for this finally here with us may you make it memorable so this is the message to her then what i'm going to do now is i'll select her and then change it to regular actually i did that because some of the tests were bold others were regular so from here i will add this simple lie here you see some of them i added because not it's it's a format but just to add a start to your design you get it just to add some kind of they are all part of and we know element of design consists of colors shapes whatever so these are the things we are talking about here so you need to bring in some element of design so we have the test test is an element of design so you just need i'm going for this birthday and then stretch it this way happy birthday so as you can see it's very nice it's very nice although i've not finished but it's quite nice Let, let's hear from you in the comment what you think about this design and if you want more of this format create more for you do you want to learn more different different way of creating this let us know in the comments okay so from here what i'm going to do now is but before i go on not i forget if you have not subscribed to this channel click on the subscribe button hit on the bell button and then do one thing again go and click on the like button then we are free to go so i've created this taste uh grace in ketia that is the name of the lady so what i'm going to do right now is i will make a copy of grace in ketia because i want to get a mirror a mirror uh sta so i will just oh uh, please what i'm going to do now is i will just change it vertically okay so i'll flip it vertically like this so that uh i'll get something like this so it's a mirror of that okay so what we will do now is we need to create a mask and then go in for the ellipse uh, mark you to the select some portion of the test okay you know we are working on the mask we are not working on the main test so anytime you can change the test or you can do whatever so what we will do is we will set our brush to uh, our brush opacity to 30 50 percent then we will brush this area we will brush it brush 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 okay something like this so brushing it we will reduce the opacity down and we have something like this now view it well as you can see it's like a mirror it's like a reflection of grace in it here downwards can you see that so this is one form or one way of creating reflection of it it's in the photoshop so from here what we are going to do now is we will go in for rounded rectangle tool then we will create a shape like this now creating the shape we will add the date of birth to it so i will change the color to white then i'll go in for the test too going for the test okay now let me adjust this one i'll go in for the test and i'll type the date of birth here so please if you are new here i said do well and subscribe to this channel please very important so i have the date in there so do now is the date the color is white placing white within white is zero meaning that you will not see anything so i'll change the color to black we have this now 
very simple so as you can see this is the whole flyer for our work very simple and nice thank you for joining us i'm bliss felix